Hello and welcome to Chasing Diecast Cars. So on the Friday of week 39 of 2018, the local club called Model Car Collector Friends had their biannual uh, model or diecast event. So it was on the Friday evening. I went there and of course I bought some stuff. This is everything I bought that evening. So let's start with the Hot Wheels. So I put these stickers on with the prices. So the biggest price is the price the seller was asking. And that's the lowest price is the price I paid for it. Just as an information. So I got two of these uh, 70 Chevelle SS. This one is in yellow and this one is in blue. Now some of these cards have been cut off. Uh, the seller could not tell me why that was. He bought them like this but I got a decent price for them so I'm not complaining. Eventually these are going to be opened up anyways. So two of these. Another station wagon in blue also. The Chevy Nomad. Then I got three of the 64 Lincoln Continental. Very cool casting. Even one in a police livery. Then I got a food truck. This doesn't have a name on it at the bottom. Here it's called Sweet Streets, but it has been changed names several times got an ice cream deco this time and there's a man inside still cool stuff also found me a Hummer this is first editions also H2 SUT orange then I got a Cadillac Escalade, looking cool, and two of the 77 custom Dutch van, also first edition models, at least this one. Then this limousine. So the guy that uh, sold me these told me he uh, had uh, ordered these um, online in the States because this is a, an American card, long card, uh, with a whole lot of other stuff. But by the time uh, it arrived in Europe, he had to pay so much uh, customs and VAT and import duties that uh, yeah he made a loss on them so but that's just the risk you take you have to inform yourself very well if you in where I live if you import import something it has to be lower than 22 euro and then you don't have to pay anything no import duties no VAT no customs so if you keep that in mind you can order stuff online at an interesting price but otherwise just keep out of it then I got some Japanese stuff too 96 Nissan 180SX Type X very cool looking in red Found this RX-7 Mazda in a matte white. This is actually an error car. Uh, the windscreen in the back is not fitted properly, so it's a bit uh, jacked up in there. Then the Bugani Waira in red. And a Ferrari. That's hard to come by. 
so I was very happy to find this then I got some majorette this these are the SOS cars from the Netherlands I had seen these earlier this year um, in February when it was the first collector event of the club uh, but you know, they were 15 euro I thought I'm not going to buy that I'm going to find them in the Netherlands but they are impossible to find in the Netherlands so I thought I'd just buy the bullet and buy them and I got them for a little bit less so still four euro and ten cents per car but you know I finally have them it's fine by me so you get a MAN ladder truck Porsche Panamera and a Renault Master ambulance and then we also got this Majorette five pack pack sorry pretty old one uh, at that time they did not have a date on the package yet I suspect this may be around 2009 2010 I'm not sure so you get a mini BMW 1 series Citroen C4 coupe a Lexus and a Renault Scenic so this was 10 paid 769 so that's 154 a car and then we go to whoops stuff falling over all over the place matchbox bunch of five packs so we've got a Porsche KN 4 GT Mitsubishi Eclipse I think a Cobra and a Mercedes SL next up we got a VW Common Gear Cadillac Lotus Europa Ford Mustang and a Camaro Z28 and then we got a Opel Speedster Cobra Mustang Porsche 911 Ford GT Porsche 911 Corvette Lotus Evora VW Nardo and a Mustang convertible now this one is a bit of an odd one as you can see it's open in the side uh, the, se the seller had several ones of these but it took me a while to figure out there was something iffy about this one so here you have the um, Vista Cruiser Volvo P1800 Jaguar E-Type the um, VW Porsche and the Caterham now I remembered I already had this one but it did not seem completely familiar I'll show you the one I already had so the Caterham are the same the VW Porsche are the same and the Vista Cruiser are the same the Volvo and the Jag have been switched out with another color which I actually don't mind because I don't have these colors these two so I have never found this I collect these Volvos as many people do because that's probably why they switched it over never found this in a, a single package so I'm actually very glad to get these now I have different ones so that's it that's all I got oh no sorry I'm forgetting something I got some loose cars too so I got five loose cars mm, no I got six loose cars uh, these were and yeah, they were all two euro piece this Porsche Carrera GT Hot Wheels let's see E production code so that's 2012 it's got Porsche on the windscreen very nice car then this VW they call it a caddy a caddy in Europe is a van so 
it's a bit confusing for us Europeans H so that's 2015 in silver skateboard in the back looking really cool then another VW the thing or the type 181 Hot Wheels B so that's 2009 also looking very cool Got some nice tail lights tempos in the back and headlights nice job this one I was very happy to find this is a Alfa Romeo the B89 wow I could not believe I could pick this up even to find it and for only two euro wow that's amazing this is a great car super fine and then a red Ferrari the 365 GTB-4 copyright 1999 a little bit less good condition but overall pretty much okay and you know the red Ferraris always cost more this one was just two euro so had to pick it up and then from another seller I got this one this I thought looked really cool this is a welly uh, sorry it's a Maisto I'm lying it's a Maisto Honda S2000 I think Maisto did a much better job back in the day than they are doing today although they can do it well every once in a while but only when the car manufacturer demands them to do it better they do it it seems so looking really cool not a lot of s2000s to be found in this scale so very happy to find this one so that's it everyone thank you very much for watching i hope to see you again next time bye bye